Hello, well, good evening, everybody. Today's day 39 of my carnivore adventure. And today's been a little bit of a mixed bag, I have to say. Um, I had I had quite a bit more maybe to eat than I normally do, but a lot of it wasn't high quality. I've had a lot of peanuts today um, at sort of two different times. And yeah, a couple of flat whites this morning. So, but I did eat better during the day. I've had um, some eggs and I had um, a lot of ground beef for dinner this evening as well. So the main bulk of what I've eaten has has actually been really good. Um, but yeah, a little bit around the edges, maybe maybe not as good as, as I could do, but um, there we go. I did spend half the day at home and half the day at work also. And I was in the on the bike in the pouring rain and everything else, and so I felt cold and I wanted a warm drink, so I had an extra flat white this morning. Anyway, it is what it is. I think what's interesting about that though is that I am I'm noticing in myself that I feel like I'm starting to just be a little bit too liberal. I know I've never done strict, strict carnivore diet from day one, but I feel at least in my head, maybe I'm not actually doing it, but I'm feeling like I'm starting to allow myself to think I can take liberties, if you know what I mean. So it's like, oh, well, it won't be that bad if you just have a little bit of this. So I need to work on that. The one thing that I did do that I was quite happy about is I had a networking event tonight and I went to that and it was in a pub. And I literally didn't have anything but soda water to drink with a couple of slices of lime in it. And I was really, really disciplined. I didn't have a single drink and nobody tried to peer pressure me into having a drink, which was also good because that could have tipped me over the edge. But went along, had a really nice chat, had a nice time, saw loads of people that have been on my podcast in the past. So that was nice to catch up and meet some of them in actually physically in person for a change. Um. So yeah, so mm, swings and roundabouts, they would say. So a little bit up, a little bit down. I do need to watch myself though, because I'm, like I said, I feel like I'm starting to let myself get too relaxed. So I'll need to watch that over the next few days. Um, looking at the numbers, I'd gone up a little bit this morning. So gone from 95.5 to 95.7. But again, that's just going to be water weight somewhere. Um, Sleep was 81. I only managed about half of the steps, even going out tonight and being out in the morning. I still only did about half the steps that I, I would like to do every day. So need to work on that. I had a few more calories today, which actually I don't think is a bad thing. Um, so I was pretty much almost right on where I should be for my basal metabolic rate. So yeah, I'm trying to do that, but I don't think I did it with the right foods. I need to do it more with steak and everything else. I did sign up for the this store called Booker. I think I've mentioned this in the past, but I signed up for a store called Booker, which is like a Costco or, or something like that, where you can go and buy in bulk. And it's only for businesses in the trade. Um, but I do run my own business and we do run events. And so... I do qualify to have a membership there. So I've got a membership at Booker and I'm going to go this weekend and pick up a load of steaks because you can buy them like for restaurants. And the good thing about that is, is because you buy them in bulk, you get them cheaper. So the plan is I literally have zero in my calendar for next week as well. So I have no excuse not to get to the gym and also not to eat well. So I'm going to try and be a little bit more prepared with my meals and try to do a little bit more forward planning so that I don't end up eating. I would like to scale back on the amount of lean meat that I eat and eat some more fatty meat and some and more red meat, basically. And I've just been I've been relying a little bit too much on kind of the leaner white meats. And several people have pointed that out to me in the comments. And you're absolutely right. So. That's the goal for the week is to do that and also to try and, again, bring myself back around. I've, I've got a little bit liberal with drinking teas and coffees. And I know, I know, 
I shouldn't. I should just get off them and just do BBBO or whatever it's called. The eggs, BBBE. Anyway, <laughs> I should just basically drink water and meat and salt if I really want to go hardcore. I'm just, I just haven't got myself organized enough to do that yet. And I'm, I'm a little bit nervous, I have to say, about going cold turkey on caffeine. But look, I'm, I'm not... I don't know, one of these like carnivore influencer type people. I'm just some normal dude, um, you know, who's trying to sort of get his way through this diet. And, you know, that's why I'm trying to share it with other people, because I imagine there's probably tons of other people out there who are also just normal people just trying to get through a diet for whatever reason. Um, so, yeah, I don't, I, you know, I'm, I'm not... I'm not a hero. I can't stick to it all the time. I wish I could. I struggle and I have a hard time. But I feel like doing these videos actually gives me a little bit more, and I've said this again, I've said this in the past, but it gives me a little bit more discipline. And it makes me, the other thing is it actually makes me think about what I'm doing and where I'm going and how I'm doing it and those sorts of things. So I, I wouldn't have, I don't think I would have really noticed that I was, that my mentality was starting to slip a little bit and then I was becoming a bit too casual with what I feel about the diet. So, sorry, something just flickered on my screen. It was really weird. Um, so, yeah, so I will try and, I'm going to try and do better. I'm going to try and stick with it, but we have ups and downs. That happens in all aspects of our life. It happens in business. It happens in family. It happens in the weather it happens and everything so sometimes we're up sometimes we're down i i don't think that i'm down i don't think that i've broken the diet or anything like that but i do feel like i do need to just keep an eye on myself so that's the plan and um yeah happy thursday evening and we will catch you on friday see you tomorrow